work. So who was that guy? Just an old business or so. Oh, look out! Oh no. Oh, there's nowhere to jump this time. Oh no, hold on. Okay. Here, grab my hand. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Oh, but well, you're bleeding. Yeah, it goes with the territory. Let's get the hell out of here. Damn it. Come on. Oh, man. <laughs> Going somewhere? Hey, Eddie. Did you really think you could escape from what? Oh, no, I just giving the young lady the $10 tour. Shut <laughs> it. I bet you're working for them, too. What? You thought you could set me up and keep everything for yourselves, hmm? Damn it! This guy's crazy! Eddie, take it easy, buddy. <laughs> well, you're out of luck now! And out of road. Now, give me that map. Hold on. All right, you got me, fair and square. Hey, don't move. Relax, Eddie. Just get in the map like you asked. I said, hold on. I am. Well, hand it over. Well, now, you told me not to move. Looks like you're gonna have to come get it. Uh, come. Oh, no. Oh, no, I hope I brought my floaties. I did not bring my floaties. Repeat, I did not bring my floaties. What's up, guys, and welcome to chapter eight, the Drowned City and Uncharted Drake's Fortune. And we're being shot at out of the water here. It's fish out of the water. Come on, go, go, go. Yep, okay. Oh, for God's sake. Can we shoot those guys down, though? I've never been actually able to try this before. Um, we can. Oh, wow, we can. What? Oh, can I shoot Eddie? Is that Eddie? Um, I don't know. Maybe this is a bad idea. More of them are showing up. Oh, geez. And we got bad guys over here. All right, let me sit here and think this out for a second. Okay, let's, um, let's make sure you can't think because there's too much, too busy having a bullet there. <laughs> All right. Um, and now we can go across because there's not as many. Ooh, ready? Ooh, I see that, I see that. Ooh. <laughs> there you go. Awesome stuff, awesome stuff. And then is that everybody? That isn't, so I don't know why the music is up. There it goes. <laughs> it came back. Ooh, ooh. ooh gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> there you go. Let us pick up the AK. So a little more firepower might be helpful here, especially with Tubby over here. Get you. And then, ooh, get you too. Ooh, yeah, okay. Uh, oh, no, 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 come on, come on. I'm gonna end a punch and a kick or no more punches, yeah. <laughs> there you go. All right then, so with that being said, we fought those guys and there is a treasure right over here. There it is, it is the decorated silver ring. How many silver rings and just rings in general are we gonna find? I'm not sure, but pretty darn cool stuff. So now we can actually continue on here, see what we can find throughout this. Uh, looks like we have a big old door to open, or actually, I think that we actually might benefit more from the moss and the AK for now, so we'll go ahead and do that. Maybe Elena could help us out here? No, I guess not. <laughs> Whatever, it's fine. So now we're fighting with Elena. That's pretty cool, though. Oh, she's still on her camera, too. Ooh. This was a big mistake. <laughs> no kidding. You know, I should have turned before the bridge. <sighs> <laughs> That's very funny. Oh, come here a minute. I want to show you something. That thing still works? Uh-huh. Check this out. Okay, see this building in the harbor? That's where all the boats coming into the colony would have unloaded their cargo. So if the El Dorado treasure came to this island, it would have had to have come through here. Wait a minute, what What was that? What? Rewind it. Yeah? Wait, stop. Uh-huh. Right there. That's our ticket out of here, come on. Our ticket out of here? Are you giving up? Maybe you hadn't noticed, but we're kind of outnumbered. We're doing fine so far. Oh, Lord. Elena, I don't need your bullet-riddled corpse on my conscience. Let's go. Oh, please. You quit if you want to, but don't use me as an excuse. Ooh. <laughs> fine. It's me, okay? I am quitting. Are you coming or not? So that's it. You're just gonna forget about the treasure and forget about Drake? <sighs> God damn it, this is not worth dying over. Okay. Okay. Listen, either way, we have to head back to the harbor. Don't worry about it. We can argue about it later. It'll be great. Wait. This time, I drive. Okay. 
<laughs> All right then, so now we get to drive this baby. It is a wonderful jet ski. Now, I don't think this is made by the Atsu company. Oh, well, it might be here. Let's see, let's aim up at it. Um, I don't know, it doesn't have a design, it doesn't have a logo, like, name to it. Okay, then, I, I, I'm not sure if this is a, a another Easter egg. I can't remember. I think it might be. How does a whole colony just drop out of history? Looks like we've got company. I don't know, but this is a very interesting area because it's one of the only few areas in the game, if any, to where you actually get a chance to control somebody who isn't Drake, of course, excluding online play. In the single player series, this is like one of the only times, like, I mean, I know it's very minimal, and she's only in a shooting and aiming and stuff, but that is still incredibly odd compared to the rest of the Uncharted games. And it's weird how uh, they stick to much more of a formula in Uncharted 2 and 3, and they sort of, you know, skip out that stuff where they jump away from the norm in Uncharted 1. <laughs> I don't know. It's just interesting for sure. I always, like, when I played this, like I said, I played Uncharted 1 after I played Uncharted 2 and 3, so when I did this, I was like, wait a minute. We're not playing as Drake right now. This is weird. Oh, no, 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 no. Whoa, go around that one. <laughs> that could have been bad. Oh, boy. Uh, now, luckily, there are no treasures to find on this jet ski because it can be pretty tough on its own without having to worry about, you know, finding treasures. Uh, where is this dude? You guys are tearing me up right now. Oh, geez, back it up, back it up. Where is this guy? Come on, stop it. Ah, <laughs> and we both get taken out. Ah, there he is. Take him out right now. There you go. So there is one more dude over here. He has a rocket launcher. Take him out. Like I said, luckily there are no treasures to find on the jet ski area, but a thing I sort of remembered and thought was also weird, it might be a really odd coincidence, but the only times you play as female protagonists in Naughty Dog games is on jet skis, because with Crash Bandicoot 3, you could play as Coco Bandicoot, um, only in certain, you know, short moments, and guess what they were? They were jet ski segments, and it's just sort of odd to think about, you know, it's like in Crash Bandicoot, you mostly played as, of course, Crash, and then occasionally you could play as Coco, and Three. Now, I know you could also play as Pura. Whoa, okay then. Sick jump, bro. <laughs> this is awesome, though. I don't know why, but there's always so much to think about when doing this. Find a way in. You know, I read a story once about a cursed Inca treasure. You don't suppose that... Please don't tell me you believe in that stuff. I'm just saying, something bad happened here. The whole colony doesn't just up and vanish. <laughs> yeah. Well, how do you explain it? Is it the heebie-jeebies or is it odd foreshadowing? You decide, viewers, you decide. Also, I used to play this uh, PS2 game about jet ski racing, and this honestly feels a lot like it, so it's just interesting. I don't know why this specific jet ski segment brings up a lot of thoughts and memories, but it does. Looks like that cable would get us up there. Let's go check it out. I'll stay here and keep an eye on our ride. See if you can figure a way to get us to that tower. Okay, uh oh, we got guys beating us up. Um, uh, hi. Here, wait, wait, boom, wait, nope, oh, there you go. That didn't really do too much. If I did that a bit earlier, maybe, but since I didn't, I don't know why I'm such a bad shot today, too. Uh, I wish, wish I had some grenades, but what are you trying to do? I see, I see your shenanigans. No shenanigans from you, sir. All right, pick up this AK, and then let's keep going. Hmm. Get this, uh oh, don't shoot at me, don't shoot at me. Oh, yeah, you too, you too. Whoa, 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 duck and cover. Um, get this too, and then, oh no. What are we gonna do about these guys? There's, oh, there's a lot of them. I need to take care of you first, but that's easier said than done with all these guys being booty butts. Here. Boom, gotcha. Wait, no, okay, you and your silly hat. <laughs> no need to have a hat if you don't have a head, huh? Boom. All right, and you too. There you go, beautiful. Whoa, ow, okay, there's more of them. More silly hat men. I don't need none of those guys in my life. What if pirates just became pirates because they were twins, and that's why they all look exactly the same? Hey, stop it. And then you, wait, uh, uh, he's over here, he's over here. I gotta do this quick before I die. All right, hide. Ooh, take a breath, take a breath. Uh, Don't do it, don't do it. You're still alive? Oh, that's lame. Okay, there, we survived, I think. I think that's all of them. All right, let's hop down, and there's more guys down here. All right, take care of big dude first. Ouch, I'm being torn up from like every direction right now. Why the grenades just not work in this game? I don't understand that part. Is that how it was in the original game? I've never played this game originally on the PS3, so I don't know if these glitches were persisting from the original, or if there was just sort of some port issues here. All right, take care of you. Can I, can I please? Hiya, ooh, the karate kick. I love it, I love it. Uh, Boom, 
Got you there. Got you here. Wait, okay, wait. I don't even have any pistol ammo left. All right, that's not good. Boom, got you there. Okay, then you, ready? No? Can the duck and cover system please work properly? This guy's holding his tummy like he just ate <laughs> like a dollar store food. Oh geez. Um, there's somebody else though. Boom, yes, okay. That should be all of them. Let's pick up some ammo I most definitely need. He has a Wes actually, let me pick that up. Yes, okay. So somewhere around here, there should be our last treasure of the chapter. So let's see if we can't find that here. Here it is, it is the silver frog. Oh, look at him, he's adorable, I love that guy. And those are the two treasures that we can find here in chapter eight. Okay, let's go this way, I think that, hmm. Yep, we gotta go up this staircase. And hopefully we don't run into too many bad guys on our way to the top. Ooh, hello, anybody? Okay, we're good, we're good, and there you go. Hmm, okay, we made this jump, Whoa! yeah, okay, we did it. Oh, hi, uh, boom. <laughs> you did like a three-part spin there. Oh, oh, okay, for a second, I thought that was a bad idea. Um, do we wanna, yeah, we'll take this, since we're almost out of moss ammo. The moss just goes flying into the water. Okay, 